I wanted to talk a little bit today about how I got into veterinary school. I went ahead and did a bachelor's in science, which is pretty much what you need across the board to either get into uh, human medicine, dentistry, if you wanted to get into veterinary school, you basically have the same prerequisite requirements for all uh, continued education in a postgraduate program. I think that veterinary school is probably one of the most difficult medical programs to get into based on the fact that there's not enough schools. You know, the U.S. has basically 28 veterinary schools. Each school in the U.S. takes about, on average, 4,000 applicants. You basically have spots for anywhere from 90 to 130 students that are coming in for a new year. And out of those 90 to 130 students, they're basically taking 90% from their in-state colleges. So a school would reject me and then I would go back and I would retake more classes or I would take additional classes. So the following year I would apply, I would go ahead and say, hey, this is what I'm doing to improve my grades. At the end of the day, I really think that the fact that I was so persistent and I never gave up, that's why the University of Sydney took me. So when it comes to fees with school, if you're an in-state student, you pay in-state fees. So you would take an in-state fee and then you would triple it and that would be your out-of-state fee. As for international, myself being in Sydney, I'm basically paying the same thing I would be paying if I was in the U.S. yet in an, another state other than Florida. So yes, it's expensive and yes, people are like, oh my gosh, what are you doing all the way over there? But in all reality, it really is costing me the same thing if I was going to a state other than Florida. This is basically costing me like $55,000 a year in tuition times four and then you go ahead and add overhead and living expenses, traveling back and forth. You know, becoming a veterinarian is probably gonna cost me a little over $300,000. You know, I take an unsubsidized and then I take a grad plus loan out each year in order to cover all of my overhead. The interest rates are sky high. They start, as soon as you graduate, you gotta start paying stuff off. So the application process basically allows you to apply once a year. Um, from the start to finish, it, it does take about nine months from when you actually apply to when you get a response. Not only do you need your bachelor's of science, you turn in your two letters of recommendation. Some schools require three. You pretty much have a professor, an employer, a veterinarian that you work with, you know, blow you up on paper and say you're so great and you do all this work and you know, you're such a good asset to the community, which I am. Community service hours, which for me it was great because I run a rescue you and you have your grades your GPA and then in addition to those three things you need to go ahead and have a GRE score or you can have an MCAT score so you go ahead and upload all of that to the veterinary portal which is the VMCAS which shows you all of the US accredited schools in and out of the country and all of their requirements and then you pick every school that you want yourself and your applications to go out to so it's like you input all of your information there, you pay them a fee, and then you pay all the application processes to each school. Each year that I went ahead and applied, it cost me on average about $2,000. Between taking the GRE, taking a prep course, doing all the applications, paying the actual portal to do it, and then a lot of the schools not only will have a primary application, they also have secondary applications. So you got 4,000 kids applying, add up all those fees, and there's a nice chunk of change that school made, not even giving you one day in a classroom. best advice I could give you is be organized, have your transcripts basically dissected, knowing what class you took, what you got in it, when you took it. These are all important parts of filling out the applications properly.